Well, President Obama was at the G8 summit on Friday talking about that, and now he says the stimulus package could take up to two years to reach its full effect. Some members of Congress have been talking about pushing for a second stimulus package. Republican Congressman Tom Cole of Oklahoma is a member of the House Appropriations Committee. He joins us now live from Oklahoma City. Congressman, thank you for your time today. Well, great to be with you. All right, let me ask you a two-part question here. What was the stimulus package supposed to accomplish, and what has it accomplished so far? Well, it was supposed to uh, hold unemployment uh, to 8 percent or less. It's clearly failed in that. It's uh, over 9.5 percent now and moving up. It was supposed to begin to create jobs, and frankly, we see us uh, still losing jobs at record rates. So it's clearly failed, and uh, the cost of failure is not only obviously missed opportunity, but long-term debt for the United States. So the second stimulus, I think, would be a bad idea on top of a bad idea. Well, let me ask you, a number of folks within the administration have come out and said the situation was much worse than we expected. Maybe our projections weren't right. In fact, in the president's op-ed today, he started out by mentioning that it was such a terrible situation that we stepped into. Is that still going to get mileage for them, or do you think it's time to close the the page on that? I think the American people are getting tired of the Bush blame game, if you will. Uh, look, this administration ought to be held account to the standards it laid out. They're the ones that set the 8% unemployment level, not the last administration. Uh, if this is a, an administration, the best and the brightest, then they ought to be able to figure out the facts in front of them. Had they moved in a different direction, a different kind of stimulus package, a different kind of tax package, I think we would have seen different results. And, uh, you know, they, they talk a lot about transparency and accountability. They ought to, you know, accept responsibility that they just flat, as the vice president said, got it wrong. Well, the president is saying, let's give this one some time. But let me ask you on Capitol Hill, this talk of a second stimulus, is it bubbling out there? Is there an appetite for that yet? No, I think the American people are very skeptical about the first stimulus, and I think members of Congress are hearing that. So uh, while a few people mention it, the reality is I think most Democrats are afraid of it and are backing off from it. And frankly, a second stimulus is, in effect, an admission that you got it wrong the first time. So what can be done in the meantime while we're still trying to work on a rebound? Any suggestions? Yeah, there's a lot that we can do. First of all, we ought to have the kind of tax package that actually incentivizes the creation of small jobs. You know, the president actually had a pretty good initial proposal, which congressional Democrats threw out of a $3,000 tax credit per job. In addition, we ought to look at the capital gains tax, either a holiday uh, or a permanent cut. That'll bring some of the money in off the sidelines. But we ought to be incentivizing the private sector, not trying to do this through additional public expenditures that, frankly, uh, we can't afford at this particular time. And as you mentioned, not very popular, especially as it's shown in polling in recent uh, days with the American public. Congressman Tom Cole, thank you so much for your time today. Thank you. Well, Vice President Joe Biden has.